on 530, the search for a shooter after a man is found lying in the street in the city of Miami. That man was rushed to the hospital where he was later pronounced dead. And now police want to know who killed Jamel Floson and why. CBS 4's Riel Creighton has more on what happened from the scene. Early Friday morning, police around Northwest 4th Avenue and 78th Street in Little Haiti. After 911 calls flood in, neighbors hear multiple gunshots. Po, 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 po. I'm wake up. I see police of the Near the alley, officers find a man lying motionless, unresponsive in the street. We have very little information as to what stems from behind this shooting, but we can say that that man was shot multiple times. A CBS 4 camera there to capture a woman emotional in a parking lot nearby. Investigators say the victim appeared to be in his 30s and was rushed to the hospital where he later died. Detectives combing the area for evidence late into the morning searching for clues, but what they say they need are leads. No motive and no suspect, say police, and not many here seem to be talking. This is an area where not just there are cars continuously driving up and down, but also a lot of people that are walking up and down. Those calls of people that perhaps may know what happened here this morning are the ones that we need to receive. Investigators hoping surveillance cameras on nearby businesses captured something. There's nothing that we have at this time. Um, we don't know if the gunman was on foot, if he fled in a car, or if it's even a sheep at this time. Several people who were here at the time but told us they did not want to go on camera, telling us they heard somewhere between three and seven shots fired. In Little Haiti, Riel Creighton, CBS 4 News.